Share the screen. Okay, so <clears throat> we got a recent requirement uh, where we wanted to source uh, prof profiles from people who has this contact center background or <clears throat> uh, something related to the call center background, and that area is pretty wide. Uh, there are a number of jargons. There are various words what people call this uh, kind of a skills in their industry like call routing or CTI, computer telephone integration, caller account information, agent uh, computer screen or customer info or automated call, touchstone keypad, call flow, call flow, universal queuing, universal queue, IV or interrupt video uh, uh, or predictive dialer or automatic dial or auto dial or automatically call, auto call, voicemail, disconnected phones, Predictive dialing, customer's channel, customer's channel, omini channel, call recording, call recorder, recording system, recorder calls, voice biometer. So this is just the contact center related keywords. So what I wanted is like, okay, fine, contact center related keywords. This goes something in the title. Now, along with the contact center, if we need to punch in something related to cloud, uh, cloud or AWS or Azure or GCP or Google Cloud or SAS or CRM or contact center again, uh, as a straightforward business support, customer support, CAAS, uh, contact center as a service, or tech support, or customer service, along with this, or the combination, and any one word. So what I'm trying to do is like either a direct, this thing, and uh, 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 <clears throat> a combination of, uh, combination of these things, or combination of these things. So if you see, a complete search itself is to try to understand it's kind of a messed up, but I would tell you this definitely works and this has been uh, worked excellently fabulously for me. Here again, if you see manager interactive web full stack. Can you please stack. zoom in? Huh? Can you please zoom in? Zoom, 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 zoom. Can you share that script? Even I have similar requirement. Yeah, sure. We'll build it. Thanks. So this was the one where it's starting with the two, two brackets and then the combination of. So this is just for this thing. Okay, contact center or contact center or call center or call center or customer care or business support or CAS tech support, customer service, technical support. So these are all the direct ones. So first I targeted this direct keywords or what we needed is something, a user or consumer or customer or call or business or technical or calls or interaction and in combination of inbound or outbound or communication or telephone or web or chat or email or messaging or interactive or experience. So this went with this, uh, this part. And along with it, we wanted something CTI or computer telephony uh, integration or caller account information, call response, automated, automated calls, anything like that, or CEM call prediction, predict why he's calling, predict who is calling, something like that. So this is again for uh, in title where I've gone it. So in data, in data, this is for the title related ones. So And then along with the cloud, all the various cloud or whatever. So various, various searches, all are like uh, bracket in brackets. And this has worked fabulously for me. And the number of results, the, the variation of the number of result when we give a direct search uh, by taking those particular suggestions of a job, job titles from the drop down, And while we build such Boolean, the result 
the variation of result is huge. So let's say in our past examples, we covered some more examples. I'll just take a pause. Any confusion? Or is it too confusing? If we have three sets, uh, we can use three brackets, some something we like can that. Use it. We can use it. So see, it's not that I have a three set, then I'll go with three brackets. Bucketizing, bucketizing. Bucketizing is where we need to improve on. Uh, Shiv, um, as you yeah. told that for that uh, contact center one, uh, yeah. that search was pretty big. Uh, so if you can share it in this sheet, then when we have time, we can go through with one by one to, uh, you know, because that's one of the most complex bucketization. So uh, we'll be able to understand well, because that's a big one. So that would be really helpful if you can share that stream. I'll do that. First, just try to check on the title bucketization only. Once you understand that, then rest of the things, I, I don't say that that would be uh, difficult for you. More the complex example, more the uh, confusion would be. Well, strings to... Uh, 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 not in this. And internally, uh, Bharti, last time I shared one of a string with you. Even that has a lot of bucketization, if you have checked. Yes, yes, sure. So that's where the bucketization comes. So let's see. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, like even for architects also, if you see. Uh, architect or architecture or architecting or SD3 or SD3 or SD3 or SD4 or SD4 or SD4 or SD4. People might write like this or people might write principal and engineer or software or staff software or technical staff. So principal engineer, principal software, principal staff software, principal technical staff uh, or uh, architect or architecture or architecting or SD3 or SD3 or SD3 or SD. So it's like that. This is more of uh, that one. Can you download this in Excel sheet and send tools? This is internal. Um, there's another one external that I'll share it with you. Okay. All right. But this I just shown you for your um, understanding how this bucketization works. So I'll just take a pause. Any doubts, any confusion on a Boolean in Boolean and why it is useful? You have seen uh, there's a huge variation, in fact. Similarly, uh, let's say if we go for some of the examples which we covered in past. This also useful uh, while we are actually looking out for actively looking for candidate candidates who are actively looking for job. So there were some. OK, so here it is. Seeking new job, seeking new opportunities, looking new job, looking new opportunities, seeking new opportunity, looking new opportunity, seeking for job, seeking for opportunity, looking for job, looking for opportunity, seeking for opportunity, looking for opportunity. So these we have simply bucketized as looking for job, immediate join or open for new opportunities, or <clears throat> again open the bracket, seeking or looking, and new or for and job or opportunity or opportunities. <coughs> and that fantastically worked. And another observation, these two double quotes. Can, can anyone say if this search is correct? Double quote, open the bracket, seeking or looking, space, uh, uh, new space or space for, close the bracket, again space, open the bracket, job or opportunity or opportunity or opportunities. And then again, close that double quote. Yes, no. Yeah, this works. Why? 
not because we have seen last time, but why exactly it works. Double quote doesn't mean it has to be only for software engineer like this. Double quote does the means looking star job. The star could be anything to give a simple example. So similarly in this example, why we have used seeking or looking. So it would start anyone who would have mentioned something like this. Let's take one example. Seeking new, new or for new job. Seeking for job. Okay, seeking new opportunity, seeking for opportunity, seeking new job, seeking for job, seeking new opportunity, seeking for opportunity. Seeking new opportunities. Seeking for opportunities. Now, similarly, all this, but instead of seeking, there would be a looking now. And Madhusudan, today is whatever the example we used, that's absolutely the SD2. Great, thank you. Why is there a last bracket? Huh? That last, last bracket, we wanted to close with this one. Either looking for job or immediate joiner or open for new opportunity, straightforward or bracket in bracket or seeking something like this. So either you write all this or, 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 or just write this, which one is easier? So this last bracket is basically to close for this one, but otherwise, if we use just this, and title, and just this, and then Java, Bangalore. Six That's just to get from Bangalore. Okay, now if you see looking for job, looking for job, looking for job change, looking for job, looking for job, seeking for job, actively seeking new opportunities, looking for job, looking for job, looking for opportunities, seeking for job opportunities, looking for job, actively looking for job, actively looking for job, looking for opportunities, looking for job, actively looking for job. Fresher looking for job, all permutation, permutation and combinations. Either you write one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Twelve lines. In twelve lines, each line has a three words. Twelve into three, thirty-six. Either we write thirty-six words in our boolean or we write just one two three four five six seven words and still fetch the right results 
Does that make sense? Yes, sir. So if you see uh, a straightforward example, which is in front of you, why Boolean in Boolean is one of the best hack. So how many Booleans can we use here totally? Any restriction on that? Maximum 32 keywords is what we can use in Google search. Beyond that, it will start excluding the words which has the least results. So let's say if we use like this, all this in a combination of or, 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 let's use it. So we have Susanna today. She's from Amazing Hiring. Uh, last week, <clears throat> most of us who joined uh, that hackathon, Sourcethon basically. Uh, Susanna, any suggestions, please? Uh, I do follow you a lot on your blogs, on your post everywhere. Susanna, are you there? All right, so this is the one. So in title, let's see. Okay, so new started excluding. So new, any subsequent word was ignored because we limit queries to 30, 32. Though we have a reserves, but there are some of the words which are getting excluded. Instead of using 36, what we have used is just six. So 12 lines, one, two, three, four, five, six, one, two, three, four, five, six six and each line has a three keywords. So I would say 12 into 336, wherein by using this, we could also add rest of the things uh, like in title, SDE. So here we just use seven and here we used a very limited here also. And we got a maximum number of results who are looking out for a job. So Karnataka connections, let's take this. So instead of writing all this and wasting that uh, limit of 32 keywords, we would have used some other keywords in, in place of them. And we still have got most optimized results. So not looking for job, <laughs> minus not, we can always use it. But otherwise, Madhusudan, you still have those SDEs who are looking for job. Yes, sir.
and all are those as it is. It's just the basic uh, titles, the most relevant title for those companies are giving us the results from Flipkart or those kind of startups or anything. And yeah, this please uh, add that last bracket to the search which we did today. It's added. This one, right? It's simple copy pasted. Oh, we did the three brackets, that one. Three bracket, uh, this one you're saying, right? Ha, uh -huh. so there, we add that uh, looking for opportunities. What will be the bracket? Uh, didn't get it. Uh, Can you before that, coding and coder above that. This you one started okay. with three. Yeah, correct. So same. This this is the same actually. It's just that here is a LinkedIn format with or and, and this is with the pipe. So let's say. This no, I wanted you to add that uh, the new new opportunities bracket which we did. Got it. Just give me a second. So this search you want with that search. So here in title we already gave only till here just to keep it most optimized. But otherwise, let's take this. Title So, how many? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty one, twenty two, twenty three. 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40. Let's see what it gets excluded. As we have 40 in it, but otherwise, if we go with the straightforward search, we might end up in adding a lot of things. So let's remove this one. Yeah, we still have 175. Anyways, as I mentioned, you would not be able to see all those results. I'll just update the sheet. If you need, you can take that. All right. Uh, any doubts, any confusion, I'll just take a pause. Hope it was easy to understand today. Not much confusing there like last time. Yes, sir. No doubts. No, no doubts. But when we sit and write the code, then we get doubts. <laughs> <laughs> right. Yeah. What's the name? Galaxy A15. <laughs> I'm Purnima. Okay, okay. Okay. Yeah, that's it. That's much. That, that's it for now. That's it for today. Um, still open for discussion in case if you have any doubts or confusion. Does that make sense, first of all, using bracket in bracket? Are you convinced with the search results and the number of search results? Yes, Shiv. It was good. Yes, sure. Uh, oh, really can you just go back to that uh, previous sheet? Uh, Notepad? Yeah, correct. Yeah. 
above that coding and coder hmm. the three brackets you started hmm. so there you add uh, that uh, uh, opportunities uh, the one which this only we have taken here madhusudan same three brackets and the opportunities where is the confusion i wanted to know that three brackets uh, and add that what will happen to that brackets uh, will it will it change no now if this is the one so this will fetch a results with this and additionally let's say you are adding this also correct that's what i'm huh, why will it change it will give the combination of all those so the first and three brackets will remain the same this search is different till here so it is again and in combination to it so if you use this also this this search is only till here no further modifications are needed and i need ui or ui or interface and we need someone seeking or looking or new or for or job or for opportunity or opportunities and if you want to add additional skills you go ahead and add and add and we can add even the experience levels also here experience let's say 3.8 start y e a r s 3 okay 3.8 star experience yeah okay so let's say this thing let's add so this three madhusudan i got it where you are getting confused see this three brackets is ending till here only wait a second let me just come back to your question again present <laughs> four year nine months three jobs three jobs is it excluding something yeah this has been excluded because we have crossed that 32 word keyword limitation So yeah, we have it. Looking for job, three plus years of strong experience. Four point five plus years of experience. So I'm just showing which is getting highlighted here. So we might get disconnected in last ten minutes. Please re-login using the same login detail. We'll do some more titles. So five years of experience, 
six plus years of experience between three to eight, whatever, 3.9 years of experience. So no need to add, uh, let's say here we have 3.9 years of two words, or let's say here we have only one, five years of looking for, no, not here, uh, 4.5 plus years of three or strong somewhere someone has written strong, strong. Okay, three plus years of strong experience. So how many ever the words between three to eight up to nine because 8.1, 8.2, 8.3, 8.12, it goes up to that minimum three and it goes up to uh, 8.11. Years of strong, maybe there are three words, but it's okay. One star is enough to capture all those three words. End of the day, it's fill in the blanks. Fill in the blanks here doesn't mean that if I need to capture three words between three and experience, <coughs> I'm giving here one, two, three dots, not required. Just one dot, one, one asterisk, one star is enough. Whatever the number of uh, keywords are there, looking for strong experience, plus years of experience, all those words would be covered here. So here we can also write experience, again, Boolean in Boolean or EXP. Or we can write years, YRS or YERS. So now we got again further more results. Three point three years of three years, six YRS of three point eight year, five year, year apostrophe. 4.5 plus years of did I write experience spelling wrong? E X P E R I E N C E. Then E X P E R I E N C E. It's supposed to be highlighted, but yeah, it's years is getting highlighted. Yeah, we're good. Okay, Madhusudan, coming back to your question. This three is there, right? Okay, so we are actually bucketizing only here. Software is one word. Software and engineer or developer or programmer. Okay, so this is one string. Okay, we want software and software engineer or software developer or software programmer. So this is one set. Let's say this is set A and this is set B. So we need a result within the set A itself. There is a subset A.1 and then A.2. So this is a subset A.2 and this is a set A.1. So overall, to make it on a high level A or B, so software within this, software and engineer or developer or bracket, so we are using this bracket. So this becomes now a particular set from this bracket to this bracket. This becomes a particular set. And this remains still a same bracket because we do not have the combination technical stuff and coder. In case if you need something and here, okay, someone who would have written technical stuff or code or coding or coder or MTS or SMTS or SD or SD2 or SD2, or engineer or developer or programmer and let's think of some of the word um oh, 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 oh. just give me a second guys i'm getting a call i wanted to actually add that uh, uh, opportunities bracket that full set. What, Madhusudan? I wanted to add that uh, uh, you know whole set which you did uh, opportunity seeking opportunities. Ah, you add also. That's an additional add addition. 
So this three brackets doesn't change. It's end here. It's end from here to here. Additionally, you add UI, UX, seeking, looking. That is an additional. It doesn't mean that you are adding here, then increasing the bracket. That's what I'm saying. Understand the Boolean logic. So now seeking, looking, this is a separate search. UI, UX, this is a separate search. I'm adding an additional addition to it. So now let's say the way we have in a set A itself, we have two subset, A.1 and A.2. In set B also, we'll make two subset, B.1 and B.2. Let's say uh, technical staff and what else I want. Maybe would have written programmer. Mm. Okay, let's say UI UX. UI UX. User. If you want to give the same string in Nokri, uh, where do we give it actually? In Nokri, you have an option title. Sorry, I did not use uh -huh. Nokri from for a long time. But I believe there is an option for title also. After giving the search on the left hand side, you'll get the title option. Okay. There. Okay. So now, okay. so now this becomes a search technical staff, coding UI, co uh, coder UI, code uh, SD2 UI, engineer UI, engineer UX, engineer user, something like that. So now this becomes okay. So if this is a set A in which we have two subset, A.1 and A.2. And this is set B in which we have two subset B.1 and B.2. So this becomes search. And again, we add one more bracket here. All right. Now this becomes set A or B under set A, A.1 and in combination of A.2 or set B under B, B.1 and B.2. This becomes overall and to make it a proper boolean we say finally see understand why brackets are used wherever or exist brackets are used and brackets are not only used just to make it a or uh, logicable but brackets are also used to make it a set within the bracket you can use two sets and use a word and something like this in combination with like this or. So definitely here we are using or, but when we add and, then again, we are making one particular set. So brackets are basically we are using here to make a sets. So now here we come, we just give like this. Now overall. Now you see, let's go for this. So yeah, it's still gone. So if you see here again, we have now in this search, we open the three brackets, but we also close the three brackets. In this search, we open the three brackets, but we closed only with two brackets. Why is that so? Because for a set B, we did not had a B.1 and B.2, but we're in here, we have a B.1 and B.2. So logic, logic, more of logic again. And additionally, if I want to add anything, this, this search ends here. Now and to it, we'll add UI, UX, seeking for new job opportunities and everything we could add. And this thing, this thing and all. So that doesn't change. It doesn't mean that if I'm using 10 uh, sets, my brackets keep on increasing. No, it's, it's again a logic, just try to understand. So we might get disconnected. We have less than a minute. Please re-log in one last time and then we'll get disconnected. I missed many sessions. Is there a YouTube Chetra? Yes, we are going to start new batch so you can join in that. Ashiv, all this 